much. Um, I want very directly answer Zao, the Speaker of the Tenth Assembly. I'm Right Honourable Dr. Ibrahim Ayokunle Seka. I speak for and on behalf of the very good people of Ifo, Ewekuru Federal Constituency. Mr. Speaker, I'm from Ogun State. Mr. Speaker, I rise to present a heart sobering motion that looks like yesterday about uh, the ill fated Bellevue airline that happened at Lizard Town in the local government area of Wogan State. Mr. Speaker, the need to rehabilitate the road and bridges leading to the site of the ill fated Bellevue Boeing 737 200 airline flight 210 from Lagos to Abuja. Mr. Speaker, distinguished honorable colleagues, the House notes that on 22nd of October 2005, the Bellevue Airlines flight 210 is scheduled Nigerian domestic passenger flight Boeing 737-200 airliner from Lagos to Abuja nosedived and crashed at a high speed a few minutes after takeoff, killing all 117 passengers on board. And it happened at Lisa Town in Ifo local government area of Ogun State. Concerned that Families of the deceased cannot pay their respects due to the due to dilapidated road and collapsed bridges at Awela, Alakwaku Rivers. Also concerned that families of the deceased passengers are unable to pay their normal laying of rest and prayers because of the badly affected road and the collapsed bridges affected by flood and erosion at both Awela and Alakwako rivers. It's a poignant reminder of the ongoing impact of that terrible event. The House therefore resolves to urge the federal government to establish a memorial fund to support families of the deceased involved in the accident to aid their travel expenses to visit the site. A sustainable infrastructure development in the area by engaging the relevant stakeholders to prioritize road maintenance and a monument for visitors. The House further resolves to encourage donations and contributions to help alleviate financial burdens of the families of the victims. The House also urged the Ecological Project Office, through the Office of the Secretary to the Government of the Federation, to embark on immediate road development, dredging, channelization, and construction of bridges across Awela and Alakwako bridges to allow families to visit the site and pay their respects. Finally, the House mandates the Committees on Ecological Funds appropriations and aviation to make provision in the 2025 budget estimate to address the infrastructure challenges to and ensure safe site access for families of the deceased. Mr. Speaker, with sober mood, I so submit. Thank you very much, sir. Thank you.